Well, it was a cool day, but a little bit above average. Usually we're now sitting at 81, but we got to 86 today. Even our morning was in the upper 50s, some in the low 60s, but overall we're going to be seeing that we're not going to be seeing our record that was tied back in 2020 of 96 degrees. That's 10 degrees difference between what we saw today and what the record was. But we're going to continue to cool off as we go into tonight. The clouds are rolling in a little bit as we go into tonight, but it's been mostly clear. It's been sunny. It's going to really start to cool off as the sun does set. It's currently 84 in town. We're seeing a light breeze. It's been pretty consistent of 5 to 10 miles per hour from the south. 85 for the rest of Tom Green County. We're already starting to see 82 towards Coleman. Some 83s towards Menard and Brady. Along I-10, still mid-80s. 85 towards Big Lake. 87 Sterling City has been one of the warmer ones for our day today, but don't worry. Low 50s to start out your Friday, a little bit on that cool side. And it's not going to warm up that much because we actually start to see our winds shift. They're going to be coming in from the north at 10 to 15 miles per hour, and it's going to be hitting mid 70s, 74 tomorrow. It's going to feel slightly cooler, not a big change in how it feels and what it actually is, but a little few degrees a bit cooler with 10 to 15 miles per hour winds. Might want to grab that light jacket because. We did have the rain that came through Wednesday due to Pamela and a cold front, but we see that Thursday, we, today we had winds coming in from the southwest. That's why we see those mid-80s for us. Then we watch this cold front that actually pushes through. It does stay dry, and we see that it is going to be cooling us off. Saturday is going to be our coolest day with low 70s. Saturday also being in one of the cooler nights as well with low 40s. So there's going to be a nice, cool weekend coming up because we don't see any real big changes just yet going into Sunday. But the next week, we see it come back in from the southwest, warming back up into the low 80s for us Monday and into Tuesday. Then we start watching middle of next week that little bit of low pressure bringing us another cold front. So this weekend is going to be on the fall-like side with mid-70s tomorrow. We see low 70s Saturday and Sunday, overnight lows 40 from Saturday night and into Sunday, even with Friday night and Sunday night lows back to 42 as well. So it is going to be a chilly overnight and morning starts. But what we're going to watch is next week when we have another cold front, but a nice chill weekend coming up.